Welcome to the Collaboration Hub, the center for your tax return. This short video tutorial will walk you through creating your user ID and logging into the Hub for the first time. You will be receiving an email welcoming you to the Collaboration Hub. The email will come from a no reply address from our business partner hosting the Hub. If you don't see it, check your spam, clutter, or junk email boxes. The subject of the email will include our firm's name. Upon opening the email, you'll see our logo at the top. This way you know it's from a trusted source. In the center of the email, click on the Go to My Hub button to begin. You will need to register an account with our business partner. Don't worry, your account is secure. Enter your first and last name. When it comes to the user ID, you are not assigned an ID. You get to decide what it is. You want to choose a user ID that you can remember. We recommend that you do not use your email address. Next, we'll need your phone number for security purposes. Much like your bank does, your phone number can be used to receive a verification code via text or voice to verify your identity when you log into your hub. Use the country code dropdown and select one for US and Canada and type in your phone number. If you want to add a second phone number, you can. However, it's not necessary. Next, type in a strong password. Include an uppercase letter, some numbers, and even a special character. If you don't meet the criteria, we'll let you know. Retype your password to make sure we've got it right. And finally, the option at the bottom to verify you are a person completing this form and not a machine. When you're ready, click the register button. When your registration comes back as successful, you'll see that note at the top of the screen. Next, we're going to log into your collaboration hub. For this, you will need to close this browser tab. Return to your email. Our business partner has sent another email with your registration details. This email may also get stuck in spam, clutter, or junk. Also, if you're using Gmail, you may find it in the Promotions tab. Locate the email and open it. Once again, our logo will be at the top of the email. The user ID you have chosen can be viewed from the center of this message. Additionally, the Go to My Hub button will bring you to our site where you will access your Collaboration Hub. Save this email in a location so you can find it when you need it. Click on the Go to My Hub button. We are now ready to log into the Collaboration Hub for the first time. You will know it's our site because our logo will be at the top of the page. We recommend that you bookmark this site so you can continue working in your hub when you need to. Type your username and password and enter the characters you see and click log in. You will need to verify your account. You can retrieve the code from any of the contact details you've added to your profile when you set it up. Type in your code and click submit. When you see the four panels, you've successfully logged in. Congratulations! And it's now time to get started on gathering your information for your tax return. If you need any assistance or further instructions, click on your profile and select Help from the menu. Here you will find short video tutorials such as this one to guide you through the process. This wraps up our tutorial on creating your account. Thank you for your time.